Yeah. Hello, people. I'm Javi Kawe. Joining us is Achara Kirk. Hi. We're going to look at Carib Carib Single A with <laughs> Irfan Khan. <laughs> so, single A? Single, single A? I, I mean, there's two L's, so. <laughs> All right, anyway, let's check this out. This comes from Z Studios. what a what an invitation what? that is such a crazy idea <laughs> Wait, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. So I missed something there. <laughs> He's all like covering his face and everything. Eddie of the first quarter. <laughs> so <laughs> they're on an adventure to yeah. meet all of his exes. His exes, his three great loves. <laughs> That's a clever premise. I like that a lot, actually, because I've never seen that before. Wait, so are they married? They're no. not married. They're no. just they're just kind I think of he's seeing each other. Yes, that from what I gathered, it seems like he's interested in her, but for whatever reason, she's interested in meeting her, his past lovers first. And I can't figure out why. I don't actually know if he's interested in her. It's one of those things where it's un, it's unclear, Yeah. but she just has a curiosity about his past lovers. Maybe the idea is to rekindle one of his former loves. Right, yeah, I, I got that feeling too. He was reminiscing about his past and she's all like, well, why don't you just go do something about it right. then? But I mean, obviously the idea is that they end up like kind of Probably. Having a thing for each other, like yeah. when Harry met Sally, kind of thing. Like, yeah. they're they're supposed to just be friends, but eventually there's a spark that develops, which naturally, you know, I'm, I have no problem with that. But I appreciate too that they're both a little bit older, because like <laughs> their prime has yeah. passed, <laughs> and they're like still figuring it out. Exactly. But I mean, that's a very relatable thing. Totally. Es I mean, especially here in the states, there's a saying that 30 is the new 20. Yes. Right, because you're still figuring your life out. And I'm not sure if they're 30 anymore, though. Well, no, obviously they're, they're on 30, but I have a friend who will remain nameless that is currently going through something. That friend is approaching their 30s and is freaking out because the parents of that friend are pressuring that person to get married and they don't want to yet. Like, they're not ready. They, right, they don't yeah. want to be introduced to somebody. They want to find someone on their own. But because of that, obviously there's been this delay in that person getting wedded in a timely manner. Yeah, well, why you know, rush? Because then you'll end up like Irfan then you'll, Khan's yeah, character. Then you'll end up like Irfan Khan and uh, his lady friend, yeah. who's got gray hair and no man. Right. But who needs a man? You don't need a man. No, but- You can be happy by yourself. No, but the the thing is, the silver lining here is that eventually you do find somebody. Yeah. If you wait long enough, but you need to try, and I think there is an effort here, you will find someone, even if it's later on in life. But they're, they're having fun together, that's the thing. And then I think, I feel like the premise of the relationship yeah. is built on a foundation of friendship, which is a strong foundation for any relationship, I feel. Yeah, exactly. What? <laughs>
<laughs> no, I agree with you. I'm, I'm, I'm concurring yeah. with your statement. It looks really fun. Irfan Khan's character is making me feel all sorts of sleazy. <laughs> like, just looking at him in this, what? I'm just like, he's so good playing this charming yet very kind of slimy and yeah. and yet you're I kind think, of taken by him. I, I don't think he's actually slimy. I think that's just the way his character's uh, physical makeup is, but the character's history is only three people that he's been with. No, three great romances. Oh. Oh, he's had a lot. Okay. That that that's saying that he had three people that he, you know, thought were maybe the one mm -hmm. or loved the most. It doesn't mean that he was only with three people. He could have been with a hundred people. Okay. Well, that's my interpretation anyway. That is uh, entirely possible. What I enjoy about this though is that he is being taken, he's like a fish out of water, in, so to speak, because she's kind of throwing him into these events yeah. and these circumstances that he doesn't necessarily wish to participate in. And he's kind of being forced into it, but I think it's going to make him more of a whole person at the end of it yeah. all. Yeah. Like the yoga at 6 a.m. kind yeah. of thing, you know. And also, the, he seems like such a um, f bomb up. You know what I mean? Like that bit on the train. Yeah. He's on the wrong train, and he's all like, "Yeah, no, nah, I can't. I, mm. I, I, can't get off now." Yeah. He's like, "Get off the <laughs> bloody train!" Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you donkey, get off the train. He's like, "Oh no, okay." He's chill about it. He's so chill, so chill. He seems like the type of guy who's like, "I mess up, whatever." You know. That just almost... go with the flow. I'll con we'll conclude this review of this trailer on this. That reminds me of Louis C.K. because he did a bit on a talk show where he was on an airplane and this lady with a baby sat down next to him and it was like, look, I need the room, I need the room here, so don't don't say anything about the elbow on the armrest or something like, I'm paraphrasing. Uh -huh. And he goes, he goes, okay, no no problem, cool. He gets up and he walks off the plane. He just doesn't do his, his comedy show that evening in New York. Like, he just doesn't go. Wow. Yeah, like, he's like, screw it. I'm not, I just got off the plane. I didn't want to deal with the lady. That's what happened. <laughs> like he just could not give any less any less f's about that situation. Wow. Like he's he's got f you money. He's like he doesn't care. But the same thing with Irfan Khan's attitude. He's just like whatever. Like yeah. just chill out. Who gives a sh Anyway, I'm a big fan of Irfan Khan. I think he's a really, really talented actor. Yeah. And so everything I've watched him in so far, I have very much liked him. With only one exception, and I say it every time. Jurassic World. Jurassic World. That's the only time. That was just like a bad way to start with him. Everything else I've watched him in has been wonderful. I believe in his selection of films that he decides to participate in. You guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us. Please let us know in the comments below how you felt about this trailer. If you're excited about it, if you're not, tell us why either way. Check out a Chora Kirk on the social media. If you'd like to help support the channel, please go to patreon.com slash jabbykaway. There are different tiers with different rewards waiting for you if you're interested in that stuff. And uh, yeah, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out other reactions, reviews, and short films. I'm Jabby Kaway. This is Achara Kirk. Peace out.